Did you know that across the world people still buy and use antibiotics without prescriptions, even for illness like headaches, colds and malaria, even though antibiotics can't treat viral infections? This misuse has created one of the world's biggest health threats, antimicrobial resistance, also known as AMR. This situation arises when bacteria, viruses, fungi, or parasites evolve to resist treatment, which makes simple infections become stronger, last longer, and are much harder to cure. The World Health Organization has warned that one in six bacteria bacterial infections globally no longer respond to current antibiotics. According to The Lancet, antimicrobial resistance already causes over 1.27 million deaths each year, more than HIV or malaria. Hospitals everywhere are seeing infections that no longer respond to common drugs like amoxicillin or ciprofloxacin. And outside hospitals, the problem spreads further. In homes, people self-medicate. On farms, antibiotics are added to animal feed to make livestock grow faster. These practices allow resistant bacteria to enter our soil, food, and water, affecting everyone. Antimicrobial resistance isn't just a medical issue, it's a human one. Families face longer illnesses, higher medical bills, and emotional exhaustion. Imagine a parent watching a child's infection resist every antibiotic, that's the real face of antimicrobial resistance. So what can we do? First, awareness. Antibiotics only work for bacterial infections, not viral ones. Second, regulation. Governments and health agencies must control sales and stop over-the-counter misuse. Third, responsibility. Doctors should prescribe wisely, and patients must complete every dose. Without urgent action, surgeries, childbirth, cancer therapy, even small wounds, could become life-threatening again. But there's hope if we act now. Across the world, countries are strengthening surveillance and promoting smarter antibiotic use. So next time you feel sick, don't self-medicate. Talk to a healthcare professional. Because when the drugs stop working, we all lose. Like, share and subscribe for more.